He's not thinking about trouble. He's thinking about sticking it close. He has backed off once or twice on his approach, still trying to figure out exactly if the wind's going to be consistent or gauge a gust. So Bragoon in the rough to the right, but Landry is away in the fairway. This is second and all important to get this one close. Trying to hold it down, staring at this one as if he likes it. And I believe that ball came up a little short. Yes, short and then spins back off the front edge. I don't so think Landry's that was in quite the, the shot that he, he visualized. That was a little tentative, Mark. The attention turns now on Bragoon. It all depends on the lie for Bronson up here, the rough to the right. I see a slight opening he here, is, Mark. There's an opening. He's in ready to hit. He must like the position that he is in, looking down in this hole from the rough. Also, he has the benefit here if he makes good contact. He doesn't have to worry about spinning this ball back off the front. He can put it right into that location. Second shot for Bragoon. He likes it. Asking for it to go a little bit. Gets it right into the slope, and it will feed back down to the hole location. What a huge shot. Look at this shot. It could go in. It's a kick-in birdie for Bronson Bragoon at the 18th. And Landry will have to hole it from the front. Texas A&M immediately back in the driver's seat shot of his life. Right side wasn't too bad. Well, they, they, they have found a, a way to bring the drama. It's almost like they want the drama to be at the end. Van Zandt yesterday, the gentleman, you understand something. Well, that's a great one of the great shots in college golf in a long, long time. Andrew Landry has got a shot to have yes, the 